What is up, YouTube? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team Thanksgiving Day video. Obviously, we're a couple days past Thanksgiving at this point, but I am still getting some of these turkey packs by doing the solo challenges. And I also have a couple of badges that I want to open. But in today's video, I just want to talk a little bit about my Dallas Cowboys. Uh, yeah, you guys see me. I am wearing the Dallas Cowboys hat. I understand on Thursday, on Thanksgiving, they got absolutely murdered by the Eagles. I get it. We're terrible. I've said that since the beginning of the year. I've at never at any point in the season have I talked about the Cowboys being a great team. Other people have them like ranked. I remember at one point after they beat, uh, who was it? Seattle. They had them ranked on the power rankings number one overall. And I was like, come on, guys. Like, they might be like a top six, seven team at that point. But, like, I, I just, I knew the eventual slide was going to come. And it's not anything to do with, okay, first of all, uh, it usually is to do with Tony Romo. I understand that. People always talk about that. And uh, in some cases, I think you could make that case. In this case, he hasn't been playing poorly prior to Thursday. So, you know, it's really frustrating to me that I see him play so poor on Thanksgiving Day. But, I mean, I guess, you know, the people are going to talk about the pressure got to him or whatever. But... I don't know, man. I don't know if it's the pressure getting to him so much as it's just, like, the fact that the the rest of the team is just terrible. I don't, I mean, like, the defense is just so god-awful. The receivers weren't running good routes. Uh, the offensive line was playing easily their worst game of the year. Uh, and we get that wing, we get the wing one, which is definitely something that I've been looking for. Um, I, I know, like, not necessarily this specific one, but being able to trade these away is always nice. Because so, uh, I know other people definitely need some of those. So I will uh, certainly be offering trades to, to get rid of this wing one. And hopefully somebody will be able to take it and, uh, you know, get something in, you know, hopefully I can get something good in return for it. And uh, somebody will be able to actually do that Thanksgiving dinner set. So we've got that complete, the turkey pack. We got a couple of hams, got a pumpkin pie and a corn. So nothing real special out of that pack. Uh, and then we've got this three badge pack. I've got two of them for doing, you know, just a couple random sets. So we'll see what we get in here. Oh, that I thought that turned red for a second. All right, we got a gold though. Okay, not too bad. Two bronzes and a gold. I will definitely take that. Um, but yeah, I mean, my Cowboys guys, I, I, I kind of came into the season expecting them to finish about 7-9 and nine or 8-8. Eight and eight, So they've already exceeded my expectations realistically. But um, I mean, if anybody thinks that this team's making a run at the Super Bowl, it is just not going to happen. They're, they're not a complete team. They have good skill position players. They have a solid offensive line overall. People are acting like this is like a remake of the, the mid-90s, early 90s offensive line. It's not. It, it's a solid offensive line. It's definitely one of the better ones in the in the league right now. But it's not like they're just winning games single-handedly or anything like that. Tony Romo's got to be more consistent with the ball. He can't be just throwing and, and sailing passes on third and, and five. Um, you have to be able to complete those passes. So, uh, you know, it's it's going to be a team effort. And uh, as we get three bronzes here, it's going to be a team effort to see if the Cowboys can actually make the playoffs, first of all. And secondly, if they can make any sort of a run. But I want to know what you guys think about these Cowboys. Uh, do you guys think that this team has any realistic shot to make the playoffs at this point? They're going to have to beat Philadelphia here in a couple of weeks to have a real shot at it. I think um, they can't drop both games to the Eagles and expect to win the division. And there's just so many other teams right now that are competing with a good record at the top in the NFC. So... Uh, you know, you've got your Lions and and uh, you've got a couple of teams out there in the NFC West, the, the 49ers and the Seahawks and the Cardinals. All three of those teams could potentially be playoff teams, although it kind of seems like only one of them um, is going to obviously only one of them is going to win the division. But it kind of seems like only one of them is going to make the wild card. So I'm kind of thinking right now it's going to be Seahawks Lions for the wild card. And it, that's going to leave the Cowboys out if they don't win the division, even if they get 10, 11 wins. So that's going to be really frustrating if they don't make it after such a hot start. But I want to know what you guys think in the comment section below. Do you guys think they have a shot at winning uh, their division or will they potentially even make a wild card? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel as well. I would appreciate it. Thank you guys so much. And I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.